Hi friends, uh, this is Julie from TJ Craft Creations and today I'm here with uh, a DIY video. Uh, it's basically a DIY on how uh, for your die storage. Uh, I get most of my dies from AliExpress and uh, they come in um, these uh, tiny envelopes, uh, you know, paper, plastic pieces like this and it's very easy to lose them. Uh, if you just keep them like this also it's, it's quite difficult to you know uh, go around checking which die you have or which one you want it so it's always easy to uh, categorize them and store them so uh, what I have done is I've come up with uh, my own uh, storage solution sort of thing uh, wherein I just use uh, file folders plastic folders and magnetic sheets to store my dies so uh, what I what I do is uh, I get uh, folders like this from uh, the local Euro shop and this this is normally a pack of five and uh, I get them for uh, two euro ninety nine cents. Um, so um, I, you need you need uh, one packet of this and uh, I get these uh, magnetic sheets. This is normally from uh, Art and Hobby store in Dublin and uh, they are a pack of uh, four a5 sheets uh, for 2.99 or uh, two a a4 sheets for 2.99 so if it's a a4 sheet then i would normally cut them to half size because i normally store my dies in an a4 a5 uh, size because i find it much easier to uh, you know uh, take it around and uh, uh, store them so this is how my uh, die storage this is how I store my dies. This is uh, this is a Christmas one. So uh, I just place them in the folder and I put in the category. So <clears throat> and I just store it. So uh, it's much easier for me to you know uh, pick them up and decide which one I want it rather than going sorting uh, going through the whole lot and uh, checking out. So. Uh, so what I normally do is uh, also with that you would require some uh, self adhesive labels. This is also from the Euro shop. This is 175 labels for about 150, 1 euro 50 cents and uh, this goes a long long way. So uh, then you require some uh, really good tape uh, and this is a duct tape and yeah you need it because you need to seal your uh, seal the sides of your folder the uh, scissors and uh, a pen to write in the category so that's that. so what we'll uh, I'll just show you what I do uh, now first of all I would just uh, cut this into two two pieces that is a5 sheets a5 of them so I just trim it across the button here because we don't require this uh, button so I just trim across the two sides so I get two folders like this like so so and I discard this uh, piece uh, so once you've got these uh, you need to seal the side that is open this is just one side that is open so uh, you just take your uh, the tape and just uh, just try to seal it across here yeah so that's here that's one done and similarly the other piece So those are the, the folders are done and now you can easily put in your uh, put in your magnetic sheet and store your dies so uh, this magnetic sheet uh, it's it's actually uh, you know it has uh, it has adhesive on it you can remove this and put a cardboard on it and you know uh, stick it but I don't do it because then um, the 
pack becomes quite heavy uh, to store so i just store my uh, magnetic sh store my dies directly on this uh, so for example i just take them out from the sh the packet that they've come in and you just lay it you know uh, like so And normally you'll be able to fit quite a bit on this so whichever way you find it easier to do just store it so that's uh, that's it I'll just put it into the folder here and uh, then I'll use the uh, the labels that are there and I'll just put it on top here and like so and just write the category so uh, in this case I'll just write in sentiment so once uh, once it's so this is what is it, it is it is as simple as that so this is i find this quite useful and uh, it's not very expensive like buying you know folders to store your dye uh, the bulky uh, uh, branded folders as i say but uh, i find this quite easy because i just have to lift up one uh, one folder and i know uh, which one it is so uh, i hope you found this uh, helpful and uh, you may be inspired to uh, try this for storing your dyes so please do like and subscribe to my channel and ho i hope to talk to you soon take care